Hi, this is Robin Heppel. I wanted to answer a, a question here that I had regarding the Funeral One website review. Uh, so Todd writes, you mentioned it was hard to get to the obituaries, but the top of the menu on the right has a direct link to them called Obituaries and Tributes. This appears on every page. So here we are at the site, and I re this is what Todd was talking about here. And the first thing that I was mentioning was uh, it's really hard. Nothing really stands out for that person who's looking for obituaries, so they do have to hunt around and find them. But whether someone goes over to here and clicks this to come all the way out, or clicks here. So what I was saying was to get to the actual person's obituary. So here's one click. We'll click on this person here. And then we have to click over here to get to the obituary information. That's what people are looking for. They want to know when the time of the service is. So those were the three clicks. In contrast, if we look at the Amos Family website here, you can see that the 10 most recent obituaries are right here on the page. And that is just one click to get to the service information. So Todd, I hope that makes it more clear of what I was getting at when it takes three clicks to get to the obituary information versus just one click to get to that information because that's what people are looking for. The less clicks, the better. But thanks a lot for your question, Todd.